everyone and welcome back to another Solved Case. Before we start doing anything, I am better now. So starting today, we will have our normal schedule as usual. What's well, Minecraft on Mondays, uh, Slime Ranch or something else on Wednesday, and then Sam and Max, the Devil's Playhouse on Friday. So let's jump into this. I, I went into the there, uh, and it's got I got a friendship cookie. Thank you for playing the game. Got the button there, and please read. Well, of course, it's a bit of a recap and instructions. Yeah. That's it again. Thank you to everyone who's played my maps. Your feedback and advice is always and greatly appreciated. If you run into any problems, I will have a playthrough on YouTube. ASAP. I check comments often. I do link her. I do link her channel in the description. So go check it out, guys. She's done some really good maps, and it's helped me out a lot when I got stuck. So yeah. So for now, I'm gonna leave this here. For some reason, we have this in mind. The toy says read it, Carl. I don't know if that's for the beginning or at the end. I don't know. So I'm not gonna read until the end. See if I can get away with it. See if we can see anything from up here. No. Anything over here? <laughs> no. So, of course, this is Solve It Case 3. Danger on set. So. Uh, uh, and as usual, we, we, we have to say special thanks to my bro, Master Nerd Ninja. So, I'll, I'll behave now. So, of course, as usual. We thank our brother for being the guinea pig, and let's get started. Ah, another day, another case. I hope I have uh, two things to do. So, uh, I have two things to do before work starts. Check my mail and pick up an order form from the supply shop. So, as usual, we, we can, like, custom clothes, but I, I, I'm, I'm happy with what I'm in. So we need to check the mail. Good work. Electric bill, electric bill. So, dear detective. Well, I must say you sure are living up to the expectations. I just wanted to extend to you a job well done. Before you know it, you'll be a full-fledged detective. Keep up the good work. Ivan Lyon, CEO of It Inc. You know who who's lying. Here's my pamphlet key, and I have some money on me. Let's go here. Better head to the supply shop for work. Uh, train station work. Well, I'm here to pick up my order of notebooks. Name. Rosebud Black. Ah, yes. That would be one gold. Here you are. Yay, excellent. And here you are. By the way, you work at Solve It, right? Yes. Tell Harmony his order is on back order. I won't. It won't be in until next week. Or do you think to yourself, better head to work. Don't want to be late. We buy ender chests. Ender chests would be much more fun. But to work I go. Morning, Miss Trey. Morning, Rose. Rose, but can I talk to you for a moment? Uh, yes. I wanted to discuss some of the. The, the resources that are available to you as a detective of this agency. Okay. As a detective of this agency, you have access to various resources. One of the resources that you have is a science lab at headquarters that can analyze various items you send them. Just let me know if you ever have anything on your case that requires this. Sounds good. 
Now, if you look in your mailbox, there should be another case for you. Oh, by the way, the cashier at the supply shop told me to tell you your order won't be until next week. Oh, great. Thanks. That, that, that's a little bit weird. Okay, Hammond. So, Rogue Planet Disaster. To whom it may concern, hello, I am Angelica Caster, casting agency to the stars. You may have heard recently about a new movie, Rogue Planets, starring Tom Thomas Jetton and Susanna Scarlett. I am the agent for Susanna, uh, Susanna Scarlett. You see, there have been incidents during filming. I'd rather speak it's in person unless the media somehow find out. Please send someone out to the set. Tell the guard Caster sent you. Sincerely, Angelica Caster, Agents to the Stars. Oh, that looks wonky. Ah, well, I guess you get to see the stars of Mine Talk to Miss Trey before you leave. She has some stuff for you. Thank you, Harman. So you're going to the set of Rogue Planets. Very exciting. The key, uh, well, you're going to need some stuff. Here is your ID. Here is an ID badge. Blah, blah. Money and the keys to the car. Best of luck and say hi to Jetton for me. He's an old friend. Ooh, old friend. Uh, old love and chest. And now I will behave. Let's go. This private property state business. Oh, it's on the intercoms. Okay. <coughs> Let's see that again. This is private property state your business. I am Rosebud Black. Miss Caster wanted to meet me. Come in. Woo! Am I in? I think I'm in. Ooh, okay. That is a cool looking bike. Whoever rides that must be a giant. ID, please. Yes, here. Ah, uh, yes, hold on while I get page Miss Caster on radio. Miss Caster, there's someone here to see you about the, that job. On radio. Oh, yeah, look at Caster. On radio. Great! Send them in. I'm in my office. Well, head on in. It's the first orange building on your right. Thank you. We kind of don't want to have that out and about, do we? First orange building on your right, so it's gonna be this one. I went left instead of right, that was stupid. I'm walking into somebody's. Okay. That's, that's not even orange, is it? That's yellow. Let's try to ask uh, Susanna. Ah! Oh, straight past it. Whoops. Hello! Yes, hello. Now, I mentioned in my letter to the agency there has been some. There's been an incident during filming. A few days ago, one of the sets fell on Susanna. Fell on her? Is she alright? Correct. And yes, she is. Luckily, it only hit her arm. It, f it has fractured her arm. But other than that... Well. Anyway, that's why you are here. I need you to figure out how this happened. Everyone keeps saying it was an accident. But I'm not so sure. Why is that? My client has been receiving some mysterious notes lately. 
I tried to intercept them, but a few slipped through. Needless to say, she is rather on edge. So here's the plan. You are going to be her personal assistant while doing whatever she tells you. Snoop around and try and figure out who is behind all this. How can you be sure it's someone on the... Well, someone here. No one gets in or out of this place without going through the guards. Mail is filtered before it gets here. The notes had to be put in internally in the internal mail system. Alright then. Now, while you are here, you'll be staying in a temporary on-site trailer housing here. <laughs> here is your key. I left a few things in your trailer that explain how things work around here. Why don't you go get yourself settled then meet me by Susanna's trailer? Will do! This is my guest trailer key. So this one? Guest trailer. Boop, boop. And I've got a computer, I've got analyzers and books. So I'm going to stick that can stay up there. Just read it, car can go down there. So it's just some computer software, an instruction manual, a hard writing analyzer. Place main paper in top analyzer, place other paper to compare in bottom analyzer. Ink analyzer. Ink analyzer. Place ink reveal solution. See the recipe on next page in the center of top. Analyzer. Place other paper in bottom. Ink solution recipe. Step one. Add netherwort to water in a brewing stand. Awkward solution. Step two. Add gold carrot to awkward solution. Night vision solution. Step three. Add Fermented spider eye, nitrogen solution, ink reveal solution. Okay, so you gotta make a night vision potion to do that, and that was the instruction manual. So, dear Wookie, I have supplied you with a new laptop that has a few programs for analyzing on it. May be useful to you for your case. There are instruction manuals in the desk. Comment. I wonder how did Homan get stuff here before me? Paper, okay. Toilet shower sink. No usual biz. To the detective. Dear detective, here's the one down of the plates. Rules. Everyone in trailer after dark. Keep your ID on you at all times. Under no circumstances are you to tell Susanna you are a detective. Got it. People. Angelica Castor, Susanna Scarlet's agent. Act, uh, so Angelica Castor, Susanna Scarlet, actress. Thomas Jetton, actor. Phil Devon, di director. Simon Teslin, main gate guard. Kendra Jones, Susanna's guard. Ira Shepherd, chef. Connor. What does Connor do? Locations food truck, trailers, mail post, supply shed, food bo phone booth, sets, village, space center, crater. Incident occurred here. Okay. And we have no food. Not to keep my ID. Okay. My idea on me at all times, so I'll hide that in the top corner. So that's why we want to go to second. So these are the trailers. So this is Carter's. So the guards. Thomas Carter's suspect. Toby's dog house. So there's a dog. I'm assuming that's ours. If we can uh, mail sorter. So this is prop set and designs. Ah, Honda 
Adam's steward pops out some designs, that's what he does. This is the village set. That's the crater, that's the accident. Police line. And this is the space centre. Okay, that's the camera. And you are the director. You are phone booth. Assuming food cart. Yeah. So let's head here. Well, I hope you find your accommodations to your liking and have read the rundown of this place. Now since the incident Susanna has all has all day guard service, I already spoke to the guard about you and you shouldn't have any trouble. I need to get back to work, so why don't you introduce yourself to Susan? Okay, bye. See you later. May I help you? Yes, I am Susanna's new personal assistant. ID? Here you go. Very well, I'll let you... I will let Miss Scarlet know you are here. Miss Scarlet, your new assistant is here. About time. And uh, are you sure they are safe? I mean, after all that's happened. I'm sure they are fine. I am here to if anything happens. Very well, send them in. You can go in now. I really want to meet this chick. Hello, Miss Sky. I am Rosebud Black, your new assistant. <coughs> yes, Angelica told me about you. Don't, don't know why she insisted I get a personal assistant, but I guess she knows best. So what can I do for you? Well, I'd rather thirsty. Go in that fridge down there and get me some bubble spring. Sure. Uh, move that over here so we can read it. I uh, think you should should it be here. You should take it. Energy drink, spicy tomato juice, water, milk, iced coffee. Sure. You think to yourself, that bottle doesn't look right. It looks to have been opened and a strange smell is coming from it. You think to yourself, the bottle doesn't look right. It, oh. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Miss Scarlet, did you happen to have an open bottle in there? Or something in there? No, why? Uh, just wondering, there's a bit of water spilled in here, but I think that's just condensation building up from heat. Yes, now, my bubble spring? Uh, it looks like you're all out. Very well, I'll go to the food truck and get me some, please. Uh, I'm going to take this bottle with me. Yeah, that's staying in my inventory. She ain't getting that. Uh, yeah, okay, food truck. I'm assuming that's this one. Excuse me? Yes, may I help you? I'm Rose, Susanna's new personal assistant. Susanna sent me here to get her a bubble spring. Ah, yes, that's her favourite. Well, I have the ingredients to make it, but I'm afraid I'm getting ready for dinner rush. Could I make it? Absolutely not. Only I know the proper ratio. But if you could help me get everyone's orders, that I can do. Excellent. I still need orders from Jetton. Dylan and the guards, Stuart and Angelica. Bring me back their orders and I'll give you the bubble spoons. Will do. Think to yourself, this this will give me a chance to see who else is around here. I've already done that. Whoops. Guards. Hello, Guard Jones. I need your dinner order. Once I saw you heading for the food truck. I figured it wouldn't be long before 
I, uh, Iva, Iva, Iva. Had you doing something? Yeah. So, so this happens a lot. Yep. Here you go. Who are you talking to out there? Is that my assistant, the whispering? Whispering. You better get going. Don't want to. Don't want her to be mad with you. Oh. No, Miss Scarlet, it's just me out here talking to myself. Oh. Hello, Miss Carter. Please call me Angelica. Well, I'm sent by the chef to get your dinner order. Why are you doing this for the chef? You're supposed to be doing stuff for Susanna. I have to get Susanna's a bubble spring, and apparently the only chef knows the recipe. Yes, that is the case. Oh, well. As long as you find out who's behind it, she doesn't really care. But I guessed. God! Leaving so soon? No, just need your dinner order. Ah, bubbles. Oh, bubble spring? Here you are. Okay. The cards. These two. And then. Hello, Mr. Jetton. Hello, may I help you? I'm Rosebud Black. I'm Susanna's new personal assistant, and I'm helping the chef out. Let me guess, Susie wants a bubble spring, and in order for you to get one, you have to do a favour for Ivor. Yeah. How did you know? Let's just say you're not the only one that Susan has asked to get her something good to drink. I see. Well... Here is my order. Don't let Susie work you too much. I'll try. Excuse me? Yes. Hi, I am. You're Scarlet's new assistant. Well, well, well. What sort of amazing things, uh, amazing things does she have you doing? I'm sensing you have an interesting opinion on, of her. Well, she certainly is dramatic. I suppose she told you how someone is out to get her because the rigging malfunctioned. She may have mentioned it. This is a complex set. Things are bound to have issues. And now we are stuck waiting for her to calm down enough to keep filming. Hopefully, we can get filming back up and running tomorrow. That would be good. Anyway, I need your dinner order. Let me guess. Bubble swings? Well, here's my order. You better. Best be off. Try to stay out of trouble. I'm saying nothing on the trouble department. Not one thing at all. Because it's me, so everything is trouble. And then the last one over here. Hello! Yeah. I'm Rose. Oh, Miss Scarlet's new assistant. Well, does she? What does she want? Probably told you to come over here, and yell at me for my awful work on that set. I told her I checked that set before the scene, and it was fine. Actually, I'm here for your dinner order. Oh well, uh, here it is. Sorry about that. Am I not telling Miss Scarlet what I said? Sure. You're a good person. Don't change. That's all the orders, better, better head back to the food truck. <coughs> and you know what, guys? Once I've placed the orders and got the bubbles, bubble spling, the spling, I will call it there. I told you I don't have any more now. If you excuse me, I'm busy. Sounds like someone is on Shepherd's bad side. Hello, chef. <coughs> Got my orders? Yep. Good. Just put them in the chest over here. Right here. Oh, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. You think yourself better get this to Scarlet before she gets upset. But, guys, we'll end the first episode here. As usual, I hope you are enjoying this. I know there are more episodes to come. <coughs> like
like I said, I am feeling much better now as well. My tonsillitis is gone. Henceforth, I can speak again. So, everything will be up and running like usual. Uh, later on today, we will have the second episode of Monday. Where it will be me and Hell with. <coughs> oh, I've got hairball now. So, look forward to that, guys, because we're going to start something new. Otherwise, as usual, leave a like and comment below, just letting me know I'm doing good. It's all I ever ask, because the confidence boost is amazing. And I will see you all next time. Bye!